ABCs of Astrophysics, a scientific alphabet book for babies. <laughs> A is for atom. An atom is the basic building block of the universe. B is for black hole. A black hole is a place in space where gravity pulls so much that light can't get out. C is for comet. A comet is an icy object with a long streaming tail that orbits the sun. D is for dwarf star. A dwarf star is a star like the sun that is smaller, lighter and dimmer than regular stars. E is for electron. An electron is a tiny negatively charged particle that travels around the nucleus of an atom. F is for field galaxy. A field galaxy is a galaxy that is not connected to other galaxies by gravity. G is for galaxy. A galaxy is a collection of gas, dust, stars and solar system held together by gravity. H is for hydrogen. Hydrogen is the most abundant element in the universe. I is for ice giant. An ice giant is a large planet without a solid surface that is made up of mostly gases and liquids. J is for Jupiter. Jupiter is a gas giant and the largest planet in our solar system. K is for Kepler's laws. Kepler's laws state that planets move in elliptical orbits with the Sun. A planet always covers the same area of space in the same amount of time. And a planet's orbital period is proportional to the size of its orbit. L is for light year. A light year is the distance that light travels in one year. M is for meteor. A meteor is the streak of light made when a small particle of matter burns up while entering the atmosphere. N is for nebula. A nebula is a glowing cloud of dust and gas where new stars are born. O is for orbit. An orbit is the curved path that a planet or other object travels when circling another object in space. P is for planet. A planet is a large celestial body that orbits a star. Q is for quasar. A quasar is a very bright, very distant object with a supermassive black hole at its centre. R is for red giant. A red giant is a big dying star that is cold and bright. S is for solar system. A solar system is made up of planets, moons, asteroids, comets and other objects that orbit a star. T is for telescope. A telescope is a device made up of mirrors and lenses that helps astronomers look at far away objects. U is for universe. The universe is all of space and time and everything inside it. V is for variable star. A variable star changes its brightness over time. W is for white dwarf. A white dwarf is a dense dying star that is hot and not very bright. X is for X-rays. X-rays are a type of radiation that comes from stars, black holes and supernovas. Y is for year. A year is the amount of time it takes for the Earth to orbit around the Sun. Z is for zenith. The zenith is the point in the sky directly above you.
I hope you enjoy this book and learnt a lot. Don't forget, be good for mommy and daddy. Bye-bye.